When we say excellence, what we mean is excellence that deviates from norms or conventions. So it could be that most people around here taking one virtue, let's say honesty, most people are honest most of the time. And that's great. But we're looking for exceptional honesty. Somebody's willing to say, hey, listen, I know you don't want to hear this, but I'm telling you because I care about you, and boom, here's the honest answer. And most people around here don't do that, right? But when somebody does that, it may make me, f it may not be the first thing I want to hear, but I may also respect you more because you did that for me. Or, as you'll notice here, the, the operative mechanism for one person exhibiting virtue and another person following is other praising emotions. So he said, you, I, you might respect me more there. That respect that I feel is an other praising emotion. Other types of other praising emotions are inspiration, elevation, admiration, awe. Those are the kinds of feelings that make people want to follow of their own volition instead of just doing it because you have authority over me or you have something I want or some other extrinsic motivator. I'm doing it because of the emotion it makes me feel. And if we're exhibiting normal levels of virtue, it usually doesn't create those emotions in us. It's like that's what we expect. Emotion comes when you get something that you weren't expecting. 